COVID changed a lot of things. Sudden, incredible loss has become far too common. And for those spared of deep loss, we are more isolated, missing time with family and friends. It is difficult to get what we need. Supply lines are messed up. We wear masks. We don't shake hands. We are distant. Essential workers are our true heroes. We are all experiencing a new normal that no one asked for. And as hard as it has been, it has been even harder for some. Black and Hispanic residents are three times more likely than white Massachusetts residents to die from COVID-19. Anti-Asian hate crimes rose in Boston by 133% during the pandemic. Women of color in Massachusetts lost income during the pandemic at two times the rate of white women. And Massachusetts saw a 55% increase in food insecurity during COVID from 2019 to 2020. The impact of COVID is felt everywhere. Yet here in New England, where the overall impact has been less severe relative to other parts of the world, our gateway cities have been hammered. This pattern results from hundreds of years of established and unjust social and economic hierarchies with the resulting insufficient investment contributing to the inequities we see today. At the Eastern Bank Foundation, we are part of working toward a solution. We doubled our giving last year and invested over 15 million in COVID relief to help our neighbors across our region. Fortunately, we have a fantastic group of community organizations on the ground to stand in the gap, to be there through thick and thin. Here, we believe that when we listen to our neighbors, collaborate with our partners, and invest in our communities, we can create real change. Change that dismantles systemic barriers. Change that furthers equity and justice. Change that can make a difference in people's lives for generations to come. Together, we are here to build a brighter future for us all. Thank you to our partners, communities, neighbors, and friends for joining us for good. 